this is the Wampa power station. This is the small one. By the way, this display is kind of useless. It shows the voltage more or less exactly. The percentage is just a calculation based on the voltage. As you can see there, the 220 <laughs> AC output. If you turn it on, if you turn on the inverter, then it just jumps to 220. I'll do that right now. Here on the side, just jump to 220. So, <clears throat> what it is here, it's the fan and the switches. It's very simple. Here, the power outlets. Um, the battery is always accessible through these two ports. So, this one. Um, and this 12 volt car outlet further here are the specs on the back side So this power bank is supposed to have a capacity of 150 amp hours times 3.7, supposedly 550 watt hours. Of course, if you just look at the size of it, it's kind of self-explanatory that it does not have the capacity. There's also an LED here. LEDs work fine, but that's not very complicated. Um, these two ports here, this and this one, they are always active. They are not switched on or off by anything. The charger actually, I'll just show here the details of the charger for those interested. So the charger, 12.6 volts, actually 12.7 idle, supposedly 6 amps, and uh, has a fan built into it. And it actually charges with about 50 to 60 watts, so that's pretty good. The width is about 25 centimeters, the height is about 19 centimeters, the depth is about seven centimeters. Here for comparison, the Vampa 300 watt power station compared to my lithium iron phosphate battery that I use for my solar system. These cells here, if they're new, they hold just about 250 watt hours of capacity per each cell. This is when they're new, they have a capacity of 90 amp hours. So you can see this power station claims to have a capacity of 550 watt hours 
you can see that this is hardly even possible just from the size just put it here as comparison and like that so even if they would put a single one of these cells in here which could fit in theory but without any additional components this power station would not have 500 watt hours.